Hello, and welcome to Unreal Build Virtual Production. My name is Miles Perkins, Business Development for Unreal Engine. And together with my colleagues, David Marin and Connie Kennedy, who you'll hear from shortly, we're responsible for bringing the Unreal Engine into film and television, particularly focused on virtual production. My personal background is in visual effects, spending the formative years of my career at Industrial Light and Magic and Lucasfilm. I was there in the early 90s when computer graphics was just establishing its foothold in filmmaking. It was an incredibly exciting time where we saw an explosion of innovation in technology and storytelling. Fast forward to today, where the energy and inspiration is comparable. The industry is again thinking way outside of the box, innovating at a rapid pace, driving filmmaking technology to new heights all in service to empowering the filmmaker, something incredibly exciting to again be a part of. At Epic Games, we're more than a games company. In our ranks are teams of developers, technicians, artists, many with extensive backgrounds in film and television, and also many who I've worked with before. There are Academy, Emmy, BAFTA award winners, all within our ranks. The bench of talent is deep and very committed to empowering the film and television industry to reach new heights through real-time technologies. Just over a year ago at SIGGRAPH 2019, some of you attended our last virtual production summit. There we partnered with Lux Machina, Aerie, Profile, and Magnopus, where we demoed our Unreal LED stage technology, showcasing among other things, in-camera visual effects, virtual scouting, and multi-user workflows. It was thrilling to be able to share the new Unreal Engine capabilities with the community and the potential for real-time technologies in filmmaking at large. A year later, virtual production has absolutely taken off across all corners of the film and television industry. Specifically, with in-camera visual effects, we're currently tracking well over 100 stages worldwide, ranging from high-end feature films to independent short projects. Being a part of this growth has been inspiring for us at Epic because we truly believe in the democratization of this technology. We want to break down any barriers between creators and their ability to create. Through our educational initiatives like Unreal Fellowship Program, the financial assistance from Epic Mega Grants, free high quality digital assets and environments from Quixel and on the Unreal Marketplace and dedicated engineering and development resources to bring new virtual production tools into the engine. We are working hard to continually invest in and inspire the larger community. We believe in this community and we believe that when you succeed, we all succeed. To that end, we're very excited to scale up what has historically been our virtual production summit into today's build event. By moving online, we're able to reach thousands more people from all over the world, and we're thrilled to see how many of you have tuned in today. We have a great lineup for you, and we hope you leave feeling inspired and excited about what's to come. In today's program, you'll see in-depth customer presentations covering various approaches to virtual production, from episodic animation to in-camera visual effects to art direction. We also have an incredible panel lined up with studio executives discussing how virtual production is changing the filmmaking process at the studio level, from new creative opportunities from artists to budgeting and staffing. And we'll close out the day with a sneak peek at some of the exciting new features coming later this year in Unreal Engine 426. I'm now going to hand it over to my colleague David Marin to talk a bit more about the current state of the industry and to show a short reel. Thank you all for joining us at Unreal Build Virtual Production. Thank you, Miles. And hi, everyone. My name is David Morin. I am the industry manager for media and entertainment at Epic Games and the executive director of the Academy Software Foundation, an industry group dedicated to the development of open source software in the motion picture industry. Today, we're witnessing a tectonic shift in our film and television industry. 
We're living through a time of great disruption, but also a time of great innovation. The incredible team of engineers at Epic have been hard at work developing Unreal Engine for film and TV, so that filmmakers like you can use all the benefits of computer graphics yourself and in real time. As a result, the industry is adopting and working with Unreal Engine at an increasing rate of speed. There are now more than 150 confirmed film and television production that have used or are currently using Unreal Engine for virtual production and animation in all kinds of different ways, from the art department to final pixel. Today, you'll be hearing from a number of artists and executives who are leading the charge. Amongst them, we're particularly excited to welcome visionary director Robert Zemeckis and his longtime collaborator Kevin Bailey. Robert Zemeckis needs no introduction, as he has done so many movies that are dear to our hearts. But it is perhaps lesser known that he played a crucial role in developing virtual production in the early days where computers were slow and visual effects took hours per frame to render. Together with Robert Zemeckis and Kevin Bailey, we will go into a wide-ranging discussion about virtual production and their latest movie, The Witches. As Mile mentioned, one of the biggest trends we're seeing is the adoption of smart LED wall stages for in-camera visual effects. This is a worldwide phenomenon now. After unveiling our own demo stage at SIGGRAPH just over a year ago, with our partners Lux Machina, Magnopus, Quixel, and Ari, it's been incredibly gratifying to witness the explosion of LED stages around the world using Unreal Engine. New stages pop up once a week now, not just in Hollywood or London, but in locations everywhere from Canada, Morocco, India, Germany, Argentina, and more. To showcase this international creativity and momentum, we thought we would put together a short sizzle reel showing a selection of these many LED stages across the globe. Let's have a look. one of the early adopters for virtual production here in the Southeast. And we got excited about the technology because of the future of what it could be. What we want to do with this new outlet is to give new ways to creative clients so they can be able to project their production in an universe that, until now, was unattainable in live. So that's natürlich beeindruckend, what man here can see. Ich würde sagen, die Perfektionierung der Zukunft, das Know-how und dieser Digitalisierungsvariante ist das einfach ein neues Drehen. Que no final da diária você acaba saindo é, possivelmente com um material praticamente finalizado, onde você não precisa consertar nada. We're only scraping the surface of what this technology can do. The benefits are countless. And the day will finally come when we all will say, green screen, your services are no longer required. Olga Studios is a Spanish-based company specialized in an integral solution Hi. for filmmaking. My name is Alex Taki. I'm a simple frame figure in Milan. I'm a simple frame studio. 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 I'm a simple we want to thank all the great companies and individuals who created those virtual production experiences and contributed to that reel. You've heard us say it. Your success is our success. As some of you are scaling up your own production, building a stage, using Unreal for an animation project or developing a plugin, we want to hear about it and help you achieve your goals. We encourage you to check our Epic Mega Grants program which can provide no strings attached financial assistance to content creators, tool developers, students, and everyone who's doing amazing things with Unreal Engine. And if you're looking to learn Unreal Engine, 
We have great programs for you, and my colleague, Connie Kennedy, is here to tell you more about that. Thank you, David. Hello, everyone. My name is Connie Kennedy. I'm the head of EPIC's LA Lab. Part of what we do at the lab is to educate and empower current industry professionals, as well as the next generation for Hollywood. The democratization of technology has always been a priority for EPIC, especially in the case of virtual production. Sharing knowledge and best practices is crucial. Our Unreal Online Learning Program offers self-paced courses across different industries with hands-on training. One of our most exciting new developments, which we created this summer, is the Unreal Fellowship Program for Industry Professionals. This is an application-based program that gives a full-time, four-week blend of hands-on learning, project work, and networking. Our goal with this program is to identify and train key professionals across visual effects and animation so that they can learn the Unreal Engine and virtual production workflows on a very deep level and bring that knowledge back to their sets, studios, and colleagues. We have been blown away by the response to this program. We received over 6,000 applications for just 50 spots. This shows how much of an appetite there is for this type of knowledge and skills. As a result, we're working to scale up our fellowship program with new students every quarter across a variety of different regions. Check out this short reel to hear about the program directly from some of our fellowship alumni. Overall, with the whole Unreal Fellowship, it was just a great experience. I loved every minute of it. I loved seeing all the people kind of come together and the trainers, the mentors, mentees advise in such an open and honest way. The fellowship was an opportunity for Epic to present to a series of professionals in the film industry the capabilities of Unreal Engine with virtual production. And what they did is they exposed us to a six-week intensive training program uh, to discover the advantages of using Unreal, either within their existing workflows or as an alternative to creating content. There were so many people from all over the visual effects industry, everywhere from pre-production to post-production, people that have not been behind a camera or on a box for many years. It was run as fast as you can, for as long as you can, for six weeks. I didn't want to let anyone down, so for me it was seven days a week, but it was a labor of love. I could take sequencer and lean on my traditional skills as a, as a filmmaker and a director and go in, do my camera placement, my shot blocking, and my previews and my storyboards all inside of one tool. It brought me back home. It was mind-blowing. Honestly, it was a testament to the epic team of instructors and support that we got after being off the box for 15 years that I was able to deliver a piece in six weeks. I think that says a lot. I found the instructors to be extremely dedicated. They were available to us at all times. Even after hours, you'd still have instructors kind of popping in and giving us feedback and giving us help and working with us. Everyone was helping each other. It was a team. It was none of these big heads or attitudes or anything. Everyone just helped each other do the best that they could. You're going to get so much more out of life and more out of your career by being open to things that you don't know and not allowing the frustration of not knowing something consume you. So just as an exercise for self-growth, it was fantastic. Using it over the past six weeks has really deeply impacted me in the fact that I think this is an amazing package and I will continue to use it quite a bit. This is suddenly I have keys to Ferrari. I can see I'm using it as a tool to work with the director and the editors to refine concepts or action, but also to actually finish work, um, which is something that I didn't think was going to be possible. In addition to the fellowship, we also recently launched a new free on-demand class called the Virtual Production Primer, which is available to anyone at any skill level. This class is about 15 hours of content. You can access it through the Unreal Online Learning Portal on the Unreal Engine website. So without further ado, we have a fantastic program lined up for you today. 
So let's get into it. Thanks so much for tuning in and be sure to bookmark uevirtualproduction.com where you can sign up for the virtual production newsletter, download white papers, see project highlights, and stay on top of the latest news and developments for all things virtual production.